राधे राधे हैप्पी राधाष्टमी हैप्पी लेट राधाष्टमी एंड आल्सो एवरीडे लेट व्हाई लेट नो आफ्टर यस्टरडे नो Oh, it's always for us to me. Yes. Well, this is our feelings, and uh, today we were just said he wants to listen our feelings today. <coughs> he wants to relish also because he's always giving his feelings to us to relish and to listen. And today we want to give him our feelings. So this is a chance for all the devotees. open the hearts well, it doesn't matter yeah. if you know a lot or not so much or if you feel that you are qualified or not because she matiradika likes those <laughs> so i want to wait for him phone don't drop <laughs> sit there I want to ask um, our dear Russian friend Govinda Mohini are you there? Where is Govinda Mohini? Radhe radhe. Actually we are not at home just right now. Uh, okay. Yes, can I share after 1 hour <laughs> please? Yeah, yeah. After 1 hour. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes. Okay. She had a very special experience. Uh, she wants to share, and otherwise, who is inspired to share? We don't want to just go. Oh, yes, Radha Govinda does. Shama Sundari, are you ready? Radha Radha Suniti. No, me надо переводчика. What? Translation. Translation. Govinda Mahini. Yes, Govinda. Да. Давайте. Я вас переведу. Я вас переведу хорошо. Давайте. Вас плохо слышу немножко. Меня плохо слышите? Ну очень далеко слышу, да? А я говорю прямо в микрофон, не знаю. Давайте попробуем. Рады, рады. Они везёт меня. Good evening. No, no problem. You. Yeah, I'm listening. He's listening behind the scene. Да. Да, да. Галина Матини, вы меня слышите хорошо? Я вас слышу очень хорошо. Вы можете говорить кусочками. Я буду переводить. Да? Я хочу... Сто человек. Good if once your name and phone number please. Please if they can put it in the chat. Can, chat. can you please put it in your in your name chat name? <laughs> in the chat you can try to can These are the Radha Das. The Radha Das is need to be recorded. And here are eight people. So extra hard. Yeah. You are 100 no. we are eight. Ek to art 108. No. You are counted. <laughs> so four five is there. Four five. We have more. One two three four five. Twenty here. Ten twenty here. Gopika is not Radha Dasi. Yes, they are. Hi, Radha Dasi is not Radha. Hi ho. You see. So nice. All the eager, all the eager Dasis. You see my Uda. And Uda is coming. Ready. Come with chair, not by sit back. Yeah. So, Ada uh, Govinda Das, Shama Sundari Das, are you ready, Govinda Mohini? You can translate for him. Yes, yes, I will. I am ready. 
Говинда Махини переводит. Саду Махарадж, Баба, плиз, для вас, ну, как бы, я хочу зачитать момент, кусочек с книги Ананта Дасбаба Джавила по Кусуманджели, 78 стих, 79. Плиз. Перевели, да, Говинда Махини? Да, да. А че? Я просто вас... Говинда Махини, у вас, наверное, микрофон был отключен. Нет, Надо нет, рады. нет. Нет, все в порядке. Угу. В общем, стих 79. 79, verse 79. О Мухи, девушка со счастливым лицом, когда же ты одаришь меня счастьем слушать ваши сладостные песни любви с принцем Враджа? О, oh dear Сумуки, girl with a beautiful face, when will you bestow for me the chance to listen your songs, loving songs. Когда же, когда же, когда же я увижу твои грациозные руки, которые обнимают его, а, а его могучая рука вот твоего возлюбленного покоится на твоих плечах. When, when I will see your elegant hands when they when uh, your elegant hands which you put on your beloved and when i will see the mighty hands of your beloved when he put his arm uh, onto your shoulder вот комментарий маленький комментарий прям буквально две минуточки small commentary Small commentary, very in brief, of Ananta Das Babaji. В этом стихе служанка, она слышит, да, как поют Рада и Говинда во время встречи. После према войчите. Дальше према войчите. This uh, verse is, um, this Lila, it's after према войчите. And the maid, servants, she, uh, maid servant, she's hearing how Rada and Govinda, how they're singing. Как же сладостные, Ананта Дас Бабаджи говорит, как же сладостные их голоса, и порой с вами не опускает голову на грудь шьямы и поет. Рада поет. Uh, how sweet their voices are. And sometimes Radhika she is placing, bending her head down to the chest of Kvinda and sing. О шьяма, о шьяма, о друг мой, ты сама моя жизнь. She is singing, о шьяма, you are my very life. Я не могу забыть этот благословенный день, когда же, когда я встретила тебя, когда я увидела твое луноподобное лицо. I cannot forget this moment when I met you for the first time. I cannot forget your face, which is like the moon. Я не могу больше успокоиться никогда. I'm very agitated and I cannot, I cannot be calm. Сердце поет Радхика. Сердце этой неудачливой девушки болит, и она, и она медленно лишается жизни. The, she is singing, Radhika is singing that the heart of this uh, wretched maid servant is, pay, is in pain and uh, the life is going out from it. O Kana, O Kana, послушай, ты сама моя жизнь, смилуйся надо мной и одари меня прибежищем в тени твоих лотосных стоп. О, oh, Кана, you are the very my life. Please bestow me with the mercy of being near your 
Лотос Фит. И Рада говорит, я утопила в воде любви к тебе, я утопила в воде любви к тебе свою репута репутацию, свои семейные узы. Все. Конец? Нет, нет. Нет. And she's saying, uh, Radhika is saying that, oh, Kana, you know, I drowned under, I put under the water or drawn all my morality, all my reputation for you, И в этот момент... for you. Да. И на, наша Тулоси, Тулоси Дэви, да, она видит, как очаровательно лицо с вами в этот момент. И как сладостно. Это она поет песню. Она поет эту сладостную песню любви своему возлюбленному Шьями. And Tulasi Manjari, she is listening this song because it is the song which Radhika is singing to her beloved. А Шьяма в ответ поет ответную песню. Бу and Shyama turns her back, and Shyama sings Radhika his song back. Очарующая девушка, о чем ты поешь мне? Or, or charming lady. Why are you singing me about this? Я все глубже и глубже погружаюсь в воспоминания лишь о твоей любви. I'm drowning into the ocean of, of your love. Мой ум никогда уже не может найти успокоения, и поэтому я не могу так же успокоиться, как и ты. Я всегда вижу тебя повсюду, во всех десяти направлениях, на, на земле, на, на небе, везде. My mind is very agitated. I'm seeing you in all ten directions, wherever I'm, I'm looking at. Я хожу по холмам, я пересекаю реки, я гуляю в лесах, пасу коров, и все ради того, чтобы поскорее найти тебя, лишь тебя одну. I'm grazing my cows. I'm going to the hills and wandering around only to find you. И Кришна продолжает. Кроме тебя, я ни о ком не думаю ни секунды. Ты живешь в моем уме, и даже когда я ем или сплю. I'm thinking only about you. Uh, I'm, where, wherever I'm doing anything, I'm thinking only about you, whether I'm sleeping or eating. И вот конец песни Шьямы Кришны, нашего возлюбленного Гавинды, да, его песня любви Радхики, он говорит, послушай, о моя возлюбленная Винодини, эту любовную And историю, как бы финал. It's the final of this love songs where Krishna is singing to his dear beloved at the end. И наш Кришна говорит, поет, мы два тела, два тела, одна душа. Uh, at the final, Krishna is singing, we're two bodies, but one soul. Brother. Yeah. Рады, рады. Рады, рады. Я нам верю. О, мой дорогой Рада Говинда, ты очень специальный. Ты реально насек. Раша. I'm very proud of you. Thank you, my friend. You have to help. Now is your time to give this sweet mercy of Radharani to all Russians. This is your responsibility. Nandarani is translating Gurudev, so you can speak without interruptions.
Рады, рады. Рады, рады. Гауран Гасундар, скажите, может быть, вы пару слов, пока нет. Плиц. Рады, рады. Рада Говинда Прабу, he's asking. Гауран Гасундара Прабу, to speak something, please. To share. Рады, рады, my dear. Рады, рады. I don't know. So these beautiful songs, which uh, Radhika is singing to Krishna, to her lover, is the songs in the stage of complete intoxication. Yeah. And Krishna, her lover, is giving back her verses in complete intoxication. So we can see that singing with the voice and also singing the words are very important in Madhurya rasa, exchange of deep feelings. And we know that every word in Vrindavana is a song and every step in Vrindavana is a dance. <laughs> you know that. Yeah. Why is like that? Why is this? Because in Vraja there is always present natural love. Without any formality. Completely spontaneous. And this is the reason why all Vrindavan is so sweet and beautiful. And this is the reason why all Vrajavasis are also sweet and beautiful. Because they are embodiment of pure, pure prema. Without any whiff of awe and reverence. So in this mood, Radhika is singing her deep feelings to her lover. And this song is her own song. She made it to express 
in a proper time. She is waiting. She is waiting to sing a proper song in a proper time. This is the art of love. And this is the art of singing. To sing proper tune, musical tune, and proper song, words, just in the proper time. Why it's important? Because it stimulates feelings in the lover and the main desire of Radhika is to completely chant her lover, Mohana. And she is using her singing, her beautiful, sweet voice and beautiful, sweet words to madden him. And this is actually the beauty of Madhurya Rasa. And Krishna, when he feels and hears her words, he knows it's not just empty words, formal words. These words are deep from her heart, only for his satisfaction. And we can see that in these songs, when Radhika is singing to Krishna, and Krishna is giving back his songs, his own songs, to her, from his heart, if we are enough sensitive, we can feel Maha Mantra. Isn't it? All this exchange of love is present in Maha Mantra. And when we are chanting the Maha Mantra, this is very nice. Thank you very, very much, Radha Govinda, because you gave us such a beautiful subject for meditation during our japa. So, Manjaris are sitting a little bit aside of this beautiful divine couple, Yugala Kishore, and they are listening what they are singing to each other. So, we sadakas has to be, we have to see ourselves very close to these small girls, Radhika's Dasi, and listen also with, in their association, listen this beautiful Yugala Mantra. Because this is their yoga pit, place of their union, loving un union. And maybe by Gurudev's mercy, with all Rasika Vaishnavas, maybe we will get more and more and more taste for chanting the songs. Mahamatra is a song. We, we don't have to sing loudly, actually, it's preferable to sing deep, deep in the heart, in the mind. And maybe by the mercy of mantra, 
mercy of Gurudev, mercy of Yugala Kishore and our beloved Radhika and her Krishna. <laughs> Maybe some drop of this transcendental sound and vision will be impressed deeply in our heart. So this meditation, how they are singing to each other, is actually hidden Maha Mantra. We cannot separate Lila from Mantra. Sometimes we think, I will just sing the name, or I will just think about Radhika's form or qualities. We put in our mind a little bit separate. But when we are engaged in our bhajan in Lila, then all these things, Nama, Rupa, Guna and Lila are coming together. And in Lila, we can taste the name, we can taste the qualities, we can taste the beautiful form. Be why beautiful form? Because their name, there is no difference between form and the name. I don't know, maybe Guru there is on connection. Is he? connected or no? I don't see. Mm. I'm sorry. So, I hope that I said something which can be useful and uh, maybe some other devotees wants to add very beautiful thank you thank you going okay radhe radhe my dears radhe radhe thank you gaurasun у меня есть маленький вопрос гаурасун дар вот по вашему сказанному если можно если позволяет время пока нет махараджа he has no question. If Gurudev is not there, maybe it's time for one small question. So, давайте. Да, я я самый последний манджери, поэтому я почемучка. Простите He's saying that he is the last, the last uh, manjari, the smallest, the tiniest. That's why he has so much questions. Вот в чем вопрос мой, Гаура Сундар, Гауранга Сундар. Вы сказали, что между формой и качествами, да, нет, как бы это все одно, да, как ну как 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 говорит Шастра и Гуру. Но у Ананта Дас Бабаджи я читал, что в в объяснении према вайчити Что когда Гавинда Махини, вы хорошо меня слышите? Да, да, я слышу. То есть, когда когда возлюбленный смотрит на форму, он забывает качество, качество объекта возлюбленного. Но если он погружается в качество, начинает вспоминать, то он то он не видит тогда форму, он забывает форму. И там там очень серьезное объяснение. У меня как бы давно был вопрос вот Гауранга Гауранги. Ну, как бы вот этот, может быть, он объяснит вот этот момент, да, как бы вот ну, непонятен. И он сейчас об этом же говорил. Он сказал, что это как бы суть одно, но э, Ананта Дас Бабаджи он э, объясняет, что это ра, ну как бы это если, прямо знаете, как, если, именно. Да, это, по-моему, к 128-му стиху комментарий. Хорошо. Сейчас uh, перевести. Рада Гавинда Прабухи Заски. Uh, now you you said you you've just said that um, nama and guna it is one, and um, in uh, Ananta Das Babaji books, it's like uh, one one uh, hundred 
28 verse, it's about Prema Vaichitya. It is said that when a um, hero is, uh, uh, how to say, when hero uh, is concentrating on the form, he forgets the qualities and vice versa. When he's concentrating on qualities, he forgets the form like this. How to contradict, how to, how to understand this, this point? Please, can you explain Gauranga Sundara Prabhu? Oh, my dear, you are putting me so difficult questions. <laughs> I'm not qualified for such kind of questions. I can just give some small, brief explanation. Actually, this is really right. And there is no any contradictory. Although, maybe it can sound contradictory. But we should know the transcendental senses are not like uh, material senses. I will explain. When I see something, I just see it. My ears cannot or nose cannot see the subject. When I smell something, my ears cannot smell it. This is the nature of material body. But the beauty of the Bhava Deha or spiritual body is that each sense can perceive what other senses are also perceived. For example, when I see, when Radhika see Krishna, when Manjari see her Swamini, in the same time all senses are engaged. You understand? All senses are engaged and can perceive this sensation. So, this is the difference between transcendental body and material body. And this is the reason why we cannot see with material eyes, material senses, the transcendental pastimes. We have to have transcendental eyes, ears, nose, etc. This is the one explanation to understand the difference between senses. So when Radhika sees Krishna, all her senses are focused in his form. In the same time, through the eyes she can smell, she can hear, she can touch him. You know. And in that time, she completely forgets, because it's such a strong sensation of her Mahabhava that she completely forgets all previous lilas what they had. <laughs> this is wonderful. This is the beauty of lila. And it's not easy to understand with materialistic logic, mind, philosophy, etc. Yeah. This is This is now, uh, I'm sorry, I have to stop because someone is from Vrindavan is calling, please. I'm sorry, devotees.
Who is this? Gopinath is calling. I have to. Ah, yes. Yes, Gopinath. We, we cannot join anymore because the, apparently the capacity is 400 for this meeting and I cannot change that right now. Okay. Uh, only, uh, only way would be to end the meeting, but then don't want to. У меня на каждую лекцию есть 20 вопросов, представляете? Это гарантированно. Я... У меня есть благословление Харикеши с вами, да. Он меня прям лично благословил. Я, я вообще молчу. молчу. Только, только 20 запросов. Только. Yeah. Yeah, share. Yes. Who's sharing? Who's sharing? Everyone has to share. Gurudev, I was sharing. In your absence. Very good, very good. I'm lucky. So maybe we can stop here. Some other can do the thing. Oh, no, I want to do Radha Govinda, he was asking why sometimes uh, Radhika is looking at Krishna. She sees her, but in in same time she doesn't know that she is his present. And he mentioned something about prema vaichitya, and I explained that in the state of intense love. Yeah. All senses of Radhika mm -hmm. are deeply focused mm -hmm. on her lover. And for example, when she sees him, she forgot about all Lilas, what happened. And at the same time, when she's sitting on her lap, on his lap, mm -hmm. 
she doesn't know that she is in his lap, so close to her lover. Because the love has different waves. And Radhika, like Mahabhava, Mahabhava Chintamani, actually, is always manifesting different waves of her deep love for lover. Sometimes yeah. this Prema Vaichitya is manifest and this Prema Vaichitya is one kind of Vipralamba. Yeah. Separation. And Rupa Goswami is speaking about this and Baba is also talking about these four kinds of separation. And one of the kind of separation is Prema Vachidya, when the lovers are together, but because of intense feeling, they have just perception that they are separate. Because also they are afraid what will happen in the next moment. Why? What will happen? And one Vipralamba is a Purvarag. But I will not speak about this. Mana, pravasa, when, this, when there is a physical distance. But this Prema Vaichitya is so fascinating, so charming that when the lovers are together, they feel separation. And that moment, sometimes they cannot even remember their pastimes, loving pastimes, which happened a moment ago. Yeah, oh, beautiful. Please, Guru, save me. I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> Very beautiful. Yes. I'm proud of all of you. So, Niti is telling Ramananda, Ask uh, for the Italian. Is Ramananda, are you there? Yes, Ramananda is there. Jai Ho! He's appearing. Where he is? Appearing. Saranagati Ramananda is there. So we have finished. Yeah. I love you. Non lo so, non l'ho visto. Non l'ho visto. You have to call the Gurdi, then he will come. Rade, Rade. Sorry. But there is... Yeah, keep writing. No. Sorry. There is too much people in this webinar, so they wait outside because it's more than 100. They cannot, uh, they cannot uh, come in. In Saranagadi, siamo in due. E siamo in due qua, così tolgo io e in maniera tale che Ramananda può entrare. 
I will switch. I will leave meeting also, and be with my wife. So I will make a space also. No, no, not put down. So if this is perfect, you if you you don't move it, Guru. Then this is good now. Or you want it more up? And make it straight. I don't like turn. Now okay, good. That is good. Okay, Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe, can you say something? Can you hear us? <laughs> we hear you. Oh my God. Radhe Radhe. Yeah. Uh, so that one. Uh, is is Ramananda there? He wanted to share today. Lo sta chiamando la sia mai in maniera tale che gli dice che si sono no non si sono liberati. Siamo tornati subito a cento. Bisogna che chi in doppia in doppia connessione ne libera qualche posto. Yes. Okay, thank you Atula Bai. So anyone who would like to share on Shimati Radhika's glories, please. Please step forward and be bold and let us listen to you. Che detto sarà Nagati? Glielo glielo detto subito. E siamo tornati a me. Rade rade. Adesso nata mi. Sono Rada Kunda, mi sentite? Sì. Poi, poi tradurmi perché il mio inglese è un, non è tanto buono. Non posso più, però lentamente il te piacere. Va bene. Per la ti mi senti? Sì. E come posso fare? In che senso? Come che devo Ci le domande. Andiamoci. Ecco. Ti aspetto. Ok, e io devo uscire fuori dalla stanza però. Rimango nella stanza e parlo in inglese? Ok. Ok, sì. va bene. Ti posso parlare okay. italiano mentre per te piacere. Ok. Dai, allora Isabel, Rade 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 Kunda. Rade 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 Maduria. Rade Rade Ude. Do you want to know in English? Yeah. Yes. Yes. You have to say here. Yeah. Okay. Va bene, ti ascolto. Yes. C'è Rade i have a question. Radha Kunda, start, please. Ah, pen eh, pensavo che dovevo dare la parola a questo devoto. 
I thought I should give the floor to a devotee. Of course, that's what I'm saying. Sharanagadi, ma c'è qualcun altro che sta traducendo? Sì, faccio io. Sono Udova. Udova is translating. Udova is translating to English. Ok, quindi io posso. Posso fare la mia condivisione o devo aspettare? Sì, andiamo. Ah. In English, you say yes. Perfetto. Uh, can I, can I make okay. my now or should yes, I wait? Now. Thank you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Spero di, di riuscirci perché l'emozione è tanta. There's so much emotion. Però... Sì. <laughs> Volevo... Dirti che e sto portando avanti I'm waiting, so. il compito che tu mi hai dato di continuare a dare amore con il mio lavoro. The, the, uh, the inspiration that you give me to continue towards love. Con lo yoga e la Ayurveda. With the yoga and the Ayurveda. E ieri è successo qualcosa di veramente potente. Something happened yesterday, something very strong, powerful happened yesterday. Ho fatto, abbiamo fatto la lezione di yoga con i miei allievi. We were doing a, a reading of yoga in my, in my, in my house dedicando tutto per Radastami uh, con la presenza vibrante proprio di Radarani uh, abbiamo proprio sentito questo everything was dedicated for uh, Radastami and the presence of Radarani we did it in this thought in this mood e i miei allievi hanno la, la loro spiritualità io con lo yoga porto umilmente l'insegnamento laico in the course of the years this teaching and the teaching of yoga has brought us so much ma But, piano piano con dolcezza riesco a trasferire questo amore per Rada But slowly and slowly and sweetly we have managed to transfer, transfer this love to Radha. Rispettando il loro sentire, la loro spiritualità, la loro cultura, ma ho sentito fortemente la loro adesione, il loro interesse, il loro rasa, il loro gusto per Radha. <coughs> And hoping to acquire and learn and over the time to acquire the rasa, the love, the attention and the devotion of Radha. E, e la mia domanda My è question. come continuare in questo flusso? How to continue in this flow? per sentire quello che è successo ieri tanta misericordia to con continue to feel what happened to us yesterday 105 e tanta unione nonostante magari hanno diversi credo un diverso credo And how to how to live through the different different beliefs. <coughs> We have to live in one belief, not different belief. But <laughs> we have to believe Rade. in the love, divine love, what comes from Radha. And Radha is giving only love for Krishna. That to believe. 
and we need to be very in the mood of humbleness and service. And if we can chant, also is fortunate time. And we need association in the same sajati asanga means same mood, friends, is more bad. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe. Grazie. Thank you. Grazie, Guru Dev. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Any more? <laughs> so who else would like to share, please? Anybody say something and start? Govinda Mohini, are you ready, by the way, or Ramananda? Uh, yeah. <laughs> Да. Есть такая возможность? Есть возможность перевести? Да, есть. Э, по текст поэтичный, то есть, я не знаю... Да, на... Рада, рада, Дамадара. Да, если получится ли перевести э, поэтику? Uh, так вот, это... uh, с русского на английский, я не знаю, как это выйдет. Это рисуем... стихи? Это не стихи. стихи? Это uh, поэтическая проза. Давайте я сейчас переведу. Давай. Uh, Дамадар Прабу, he's a drama writer. Yeah. And uh, now he wants to dedicate to Radika some poetical prose and he he doesn't know whether um, it can be translated good or how <laughs> but he will we will try together hey, very nice beautiful у меня есть много произведений но вот это коротенькое коротенькое воззвание мы можем начать этот бесконечный диалог вот с этой, этой короткой реплики, которая сейчас прозвучит. Если мы, если получится, то мы продолжим однажды этот бесконечный диалог. Uh, he has many, uh, many poems. And uh, this uh, one is the beginning. It's a small, how to say, small poetry. Uh, small poetry towards Radhika. Я теку за тобой вопреки законам этого мира. Честно говоря, ну, здесь, наверное, Нандара не лучше бы перевела, потому что она профессиональный переводчик. Мне а, хорошо, я попытаюсь, но я ну, не ручаюсь, что прям каждое слово смогу правильно перевести. Я теку за тобой I'm в follow... законы этого мира. I'm, uh, I'm flowing after you, regardless the laws of this world. Я теку за тобой вверх. I'm flowing after you up. К звездам. Up to the stars. К тем звездам, что украшают твои темные покровы. To the stars, which are beautifying your dark garments. Твои нежно сапфировые одежды. Your, your, your very tender sapphire garments. 
моя прозрачность не замутит твой сладостный образ. And uh, I am transparent, so uh, it will be good for your image. I will not disturb your image because I am transparent. Ты проливаешь на меня потоки милости, увеличивая объем моей страстной текучести. Ты проливаешь на меня yeah. потоки милости. You are, you are bestowing to me so much mercy. Увеличивая объем моей страстной текучести. And my, my, my passion becomes bigger. Я жду воспламенения. I am waiting to be, how to say, to be like fire, to be in flame. Как жидкий эфир. Эфир. <laughs> like, like, like liquid sky. Как жидкий эфир цельного горения. I want, I want to inflammate to be like fire, to yeah. fire. Я жажду этого внутреннего жара. I'm very eagerly waiting for this inner, inner flame, inner fire. Жара по тебе. Eagerness for you, this fire for you. Yeah. No time, no time. You are the mystery of all mysteries. Источник моей вечности. You are the source of my eternity. Жизнь жизни моей. You are the life of my life. Ратика. Мое эго отравлено сладостью текущей из твоих лотосных стоп. My ego is poisoned by the sweetness which is soothing from your lotus fits. Оно в замешательстве. This ego is puzzled. Оно теряет смысл своего отделенного существования. This ego cannot be separated anymore because it's like no sense losing the sense. И жаждет абсолютной принадлежности тебе. And this ego wants to be yours. Вот. Не знаю, This насколько is это the poetry. Не знаю, насколько... Насколько... Рады! Рады! Рады, рады, баба. My, sorry, my translation was not poetical enough. Обязательно. But in Russian, it, in Russian, it was, it, it's, it, it was very beautiful. Beautiful translation and Damodar poetry is good. One sent to me and one Praneshwara. Вы ссылаете один вариант мне, запишите это мне и про Нешвара тоже про вы вышлите. Хорошо. Джай Рада. Хорошо. Also, uh, we have Shridhar Maharaj with us today. Shridhar Maharaj, to everybody. Shridhar Maharaj, ki jai. 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 No, Maharaj, we no. are all crying. It's first time. It's first time we are taking part in a in a Zoom. We never did this before. So when I heard that it will be something about about how Radhika 
is influencing our life. So I thought that, okay, we will try to do it. Really, I... I I have with me Achutarupa, Antaranga, my disciple, and one boy who came once to my program, and he's so happy to come just today and visit me. So I understand that it was Shimati Arani who brought him <coughs> today to, to see you, Gurudev, and all the Bhaktas. Yeah. And then yesterday we had a very nice celebration yeah. of uh, Radha Astami here. And uh, uh, so we are very inspired to see all of you. And we are very inspired to uh, to take your association and and, and uh, uh, please give us our mercy, give us uh, your mercy, so that we can improve our our spiritual life and our <coughs> try to serve Shimati Radhika because we understand that without her mercy we cannot do anything. I especially experienced. This last last time when uh, uh, practically I'm like a uh, nurse, being all the time and taking care about Achutarupa. So I'm not preaching that much, that much. So I'm relying only on on the mercy at, at the moment. Yeah, oh, what uh, we do. Uh, Bless me also that we also live in the mercy of <laughs> Good <or bad. laughs> <laughs> Guru Dev. <laughs> so I need your blessing. Yeah, we are depending on your mercy. Нет, нет, мы полностью зависим от вашей милости. And we cannot wait to go and see you, but we cannot. This COVID don't allow us. So I'm crying every day, being separated. Yeah. Please pray for us to be able to to go and and see you again and have all of, of your association. See, we need it Suniti like life. Uh, Maharaj Suniti is here. Gaura yes, Chandra. I've seen that. Gaura Sunali is here. Jai Jai Sri Radha Shyam. Yeah, and I see also Radha Mohan from Russia. Yes. He's also in the meeting. That yes, yes. The people, yeah, those are people know. I've seen before, so so gotta show them rather rather. A pranitual Uddhav is here. Chandra is here. Yes, Hari Hari Bol, Hari Bol, Bandarasana. Maharani is here. Yes, Maharani, I I see you are very happy to have a Guru Dev Association, but we are separated. <laughs> Gopika is here. Yes, Gopika Danta was pranam. <laughs> and all right. your Japanese beauties. Hari Hari Bo. Japanese are here. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Jananda is coming. Okay, wow. Hare Rashi Dara Maharaji, Dandavat, nice to meet you. Oh, Hare Bol, my sister. Nice to hear you. Nice to hear you, Dandavat. Nice to hear you, Dandavat. Nice to hear you, Dandavat. Jananda Maharaji is coming. Yes. So they are lucky they can come, but we cannot come from Poland. It's not possible. My God. They don't give uh, uh, us any tourist visas, so it's not possible. I don't know how you arrange maybe by the by the yoga visas or something, but we cannot do it at the moment. Yeah. Guru Dev, I'm very happy to see you in a good shape and and laughing. Yeah, my eyes. Must see. Radha Rani Masi is all going well. So please pray for us to be able to join you as soon as possible. 
Before yeah. I leave this body, I don't know. It is, uh, so I'm so afraid not being able to go and see you all. <laughs> I'm, no, I'm not mean, exaggerating. You have classes and you give some harikatha and share. Zoom yes, classes. We will, we will join. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, and thank you, you very much. So now I will listen what the other people have to say. I don't want to take all your time. Radhe, Radhe. Radhe, Radhe. Radhe, Radhe. So, thank you, Maharaj, for joining us here in the Radha Dasyam exchange. And I would like to ask uh, any other devotee, Govinda Mohini, are you ready to share now? She's now the translator. Oh, you are now. Okay, you are now the translator. Just now she said. And Ramananda is here, or anybody who would like to share from Germany, from Switzerland, from Italy, from Croatia. Please don't be shy. Maharani, you want to share? Maharani, you want to share something? Switzerland. Don't be shy. Switzerland. Gopika will say. Okay. Yeah. Hey, Gopika. Give the Gopika. Give the Gopika. All the given. No, this picks it. Uh, we are back in a second. Sorry. I know. Actually, <laughs> 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 I don't know, Gurudev asked um, that I share something about Radharani. <laughs> I'm a little shy. <laughs> Actually, for me, uh, I just want to share um, every day, whatever we do, always keep her lotus feet in our front. And uh, it doesn't matter what, what we are doing, if it is driving to the work or taking care of our children or cooking or brushing teeth. <laughs> if, um, am I on? If everything, I feel if everything is always, uh, her lotus feet are always on my head, 
if I'm in every moment taking the dust of her lotus feet, then everything I do becomes my seva for her and it becomes a seva in the flow of love. This is any realization that comes is only because of Guru their mercy. And it means, say, let's say, say brushing the teeth. Why I'm brushing teeth, Gurudev is always saying, he says, I brush my teeth to make my mouth fragrant. And because when I will eat prasadam, my mouth will be pure to receive that mercy. And what is in prasad? It's the lip to lip exchange of Radha Mohan. So I have to be pure to take that mercy inside of me. And uh, when I comb the hair of my daughter, I'm keeping the lotus feet of Radharani on my, on my, her dust on my head. It's no matter if it's my daughter or whoever it is, you know, like you, everything you do, you can relate to this love. It's, it's nothing is high or nothing is low. If you are blooming, it's also seva. If you're writing, you are writing for her. If you are if you are uh, walking, you are practicing with her to go for Abhisari, you know, like she's with you in every moment, then love is always with you and Gurudev is always with you. So, I not prepare anything, so that's all I want to share. And uh, I'm so thankful to, to all family because all of you are helping to grow more deep in this in this Radha Darsyam path. And I'm very, I would not have nothing without all of you. You are blessing in every moment. So I'm so thankful for all brothers and sisters. Please bless me that I will become more humble to, to serve Radharani. Radhe Radhe, everyone. I also not prepare anything. I also always have to wait what inspiration coming when I'm sitting in circle of my brothers and sisters and Guru Dev. So, yesterday Gopinath, he asked one very interesting question. Yesterday we celebrate Radhastami, birthday of Shrimati Radhika. And Gopinath asking how this is matching to our Manjari Bhav when we speak about the birth of the appearance of Radhika when Brishad Banu found her in the river as a small baby. How this is matching to our Manjari sadhana. And Gurudev explained that actually we don't change our mood. We are Manjari and we have a birthday party with our Radharani. <laughs> so in that, in that birthday party, also you experience in real life also, you speak maybe the old stories, you know, your birth and this and that, and, but it's not birth now. We have party with our Swamini. That mood never changed. We watching the drama, of little Radhika and we act 
thing outside Kila of appearance of Radha Rani, but inside Muth is we are with Radha Rani and she is a uh, 14 years old. So that was very interesting sharing of Gurudev. And in that connection, I also thought that in all circumstances we are, we have to fix our mood to come in this sty bar, in this mood that will never change in any circumstances. And sometimes I'm thinking when we are in the Shiva temple, Hanuman is there and Shiva is there and Ganesh is there and Parvati is there and Anapuna is there. So how we do the worship of these personalities and I'm learning from Gurudev that whoever you meet, you only ask for blessing that I can reach mm -hmm. my goal to become Radha Dasi. <laughs> You, you ask to anyone and in a humble mood, you even ask your friends, your family members, your superiors, your inferiors, you ask everyone, please bless me that I can reach my goal to become Radha Dasi. Mm -hmm. So this mood never changed in all circumstances. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Um first of all I'm very um feel very blessed and humbled to be part of this uh, sharing today and I really apologize for this mistake with that we had not the capacity to have more than 100, but now we have. So we see how uh, eager our family is to take part in this Radashtami festival, which was yesterday. It was the appearance day of our Swamini, but as Dora Sundar, uh, sorry, Dora Chandra said, it was not the appearance day at her birth. It's for us, Gaudiya Vaishnavas, that we pray that she appears in our heart every day mm -hmm. and yesterday was the culmination of that celebration and it was a day full of love and full of emotions and it was a big party and we feel that all over all our brothers and sisters have celebrated as well and one realization came to me um, out of this celebration yesterday was that <coughs> In order to love someone very deeply, you have to know that person. That person has to be introduced to you. So if we want to love Radharani, we have to know about her. And we have to get we have to be introduced to her. And that is by our Guru Devs, our Guru Manjari's mercy, that she is introducing us. She's telling us about her. But now in order for this love to grow more intensely and to start like really feeling and speaking to her, of course, we have to grow more in our spiritual identity, in our sarup. But we are not there yet. I'm not there yet. So how can I how can I know how can I know that she responds? Because in order for love to happen, it needs a response. So I was feeling like where is the response, you know? But actually, I realized the response is always there. Mm -hmm. She's responding. When my heart opens, when my heart is more loving, that's her response. When I get very close association of God brothers and God sisters, that's her response. When she gives me beautiful children in my life, that is her response. So I'm always looking for the response, but I'm not seeing that she's responding all the time. So that I feel then, oh, I am so fortunate. I got a, a very uh, a nice Guru Dev. I got a nice wife. But I don't see that actually she gave it to me. It's not me who did it. 
So that that feeling to bring that love back to her again, and that gratefulness that I feel that that increases the loving relationship with her. And one day for sure, she will also manifest more to me, to us, and we can really touch, feel and speak to her. But in the meantime, I feel we have to see her in all the circumstances that she's creating for us. She's creating so favorable and loving circumstances. And this we should not forget. She's always responding to our love. Love and love. One by one, everyone can. Love and love. So nice to be with you. We had such a wonderful celebration yesterday, and you were all, you were all here. The whole family was here. The energy that we felt, the love that we felt, it was running through not only the people here in the Vinayan, but through the whole family on online as well. In one of our technical poses, we were talking a little bit about verse number seventy-nine from the Rapakus Banjari. Where Tulas is saying that she looks everywhere in the forest and sees Swamini. And this is a really, and who did ever give a, a beautiful explanation of this? And, and it's really a bit my experience of spirituality. As you know, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a child in spiritual terms, growing up fast maybe, but still a, a child. And what my experience has been in my life has been small experiences of divine love and it's only when i came here and met Guru Dev and my brothers and sisters you too that i came to understand what that divine love was where it came from that it comes from Brahma. and now what it seems like the task is to me it was together with what Gopinath said and Gopika said as well is, is not to wait and to look to pray that the love comes to us, but to open my eyes, open my heart, and see that it's already here. It's already around us, and we just need to feel it and see that it is in our lives, and every act we do is what we always say. Every small thing, from brushing teeth to scratching our ear, there's divine love right there. If we just turn our head, open our ears, open our eyes, open our hearts, and feel it. Praneshwara. This is a Praneshwara. Radhe, my name is Praneshwara. Loud little. It is the first time I'm I'm sharing like something like uh, oh. <laughs> uh, when I first time came here in 2011 and I was a little bit shocked. I didn't know uh, at all where where I am, where am I? And we uh, drive in the car with uh, uh, dear Gurudev and I was watching all these conditions here in Vrindavan. And I was wondering how they, the cows are surviving here with all, with all these horns and all these uh, gas tubes. Uh, uh, straight into the nose, and and I asked Guru David uh, that uh, how the cows survive here in these kind of conditions, and in Estonia cows would be dead, kaput in the minute in this kind of conditions, <laughs> and then Guru Dev answered. The cows here enjoying it. <laughs> I didn't understand, <laughs> but now I understand. Here in Vrindavan, condition doesn't matter. This kind of conditions, I am enjoying every minute, every second. I'm here. I'm enjoying, and I also. Uh, Guru Dev gave me mantras and so on. I also learned how to properly uh, meditate from cows. 
uh, uh, because the cows kind of uh, mm, news doing like like, like <laughs> and proper meditating is also yeah. like musing or doing 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 yes <laughs> properly this is the proper way of meditation <laughs> rather rather thank you then you can touch us yes yeah that see rather rather uh, I'm Pia Dasi from Tokyo, Japan, and uh, I am uh, less experienced than uh, other, other uh, devotees. Uh, actually, in my experience, three years ago, it's uh, 2018, September 16, I happened to ch have a chance to come to Eastern Tokyo. I never know, I don't know, I didn't know anything about Krishna and also especially for Radharan. Yeah, just Krishna knows because there are some Indian friends name is Krishna or something. Yeah, I know the Indian gods are uh, Vishnu, <laughs> Shiva and Brahma, but some people say uh, Krishna is so special. But anyway, yeah, I happen to have a chance to come to this country. Then I don't know anything and yeah, but uh, for the uh, internet web check, that it's a Krishna temple. But then I went there. However, that day is a Radha stuff. Oh. I don't know, I didn't know anything about that. And uh, most of the audience there are Indian. And uh, I asked I asked something, yeah, what is it today? And this is a Krishna temple, isn't it? But they say, oh, today is Radha Raru. But I don't know, what is Radha Raru? Uh, it's a lady, a great, great. Who, who is, who is uh, Radha? Ah, it's a uh, uh, lady next to Krishna. Who is Krishna? Uh, they are there. Uh, I don't know anything. And uh, they are all Indian. I don't know. Uh, they are. It is uh, probably uh, other plant. <laughs> but then, yeah, I checked uh, some uh, books around there that is uh, written by Rapa. And oh, this knowledge, this kind of knowledge is so special. I never know that. Then I'm gradually interested in that. And then, yeah, I happen to get the um, chance to read um, <coughs> Jain Maharaj book through Amazon Kindle. Then, yeah, I changed from Eastern to uh, Jain Maharaj. It is a uh, uh, December 2018, so just two or three months experience of this. No, so no one knows I'm from this one to here. And now, yeah, so less than three years experience because uh, tomorrow is my three years experience to come to the other side. Yeah. Oh. So, uh, yeah. so now is uh, I'm full of the ladders machine. And also, yeah, any love, any love. So my life is especially yeah, wholly changed. Thank you very much. My But my soul is. <laughs> Yeah. 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 And I'm in it, or we in a great luck to uh, get the visa, you no? Know? And uh, so this was the greatest mercy I can uh, say. Um, because I couldn't uh, think that we get it some weeks before. And now I can feel at the time. Mm -hmm. We have for 
our spiritual um uh, uh, development yes is very limited and so i try to use every second here to get up this or to the to growing like a slump sponge sponge punch like a sponge yeah <coughs> to get everything here and we are so lucky no problem that we in this society and especially here in this uh what is thing what to say is uh, like a, a, a cave. Cave. cave like a cave yes <laughs> under the temple and uh, some roof is moving or coming down but it's like a cave and it's easy to meditate on a cave in <laughs> in, in Trindavan or in Govardhan where uh, Radha and Krishna are playing so and this is also for the meditation it's important to be there even if we when we chant Krishna and Radhika's holy names then we have to be there not here in this material world and uh, this comes very easy here in this place in, in the underground from Florence because uh, it's easy to meditate on this on the other side of the spiritual world. Yeah, yeah. So, then when we when we chant here in this place and our meditation is also automatically more close to the spiritual world. And that I can feel this time very much. And yesterday this uh Radashami celebration was so beautiful. And um, I cannot tell how happy I am to be here this year on Nadashtami. This is really a, a great mercy, I can feel, because of this imitation by the uh, material time of this. So, dear brothers and sisters from the Cape, we turn down, go down. How you like to see it? Um, big hugs, all our love to all of you. Thank you, and hope to see you soon. And that you also get the chance to come here to be with Guruji. It's uh, unbelievable, uh, wertvoll. Yeah, I was very touched by this poem. What is this? Yamada, thank you for sharing your deep feelings, the sky and the stars, Shimati, and the beautiful feelings. And we come to Vrindavan, like, like Arasuna said, we want to have feelings. And the other day we were sharing how to develop the feelings, the feelings they come from inside, they go from inside to outside. So when we want to develop our spiritual identity, our mantra bath, it comes from inside, goes to outside. It's not that we can, with this body in this world, wait for some magic to happen, and then I will be there. No, it is like in my heart, I am always praying to Buddha Manjari and to Swamini, and with the help of all them, my brothers and sisters, my group, 
through the then inside can come outside. This is the way it is the inner fire, the flame of this intense desire. And I was thinking, yes, what is Mahabhav? What is Shimati Radhika's highest, highest ecstasy? It's her intense flame of Krishna, for Moha. She is a living fire of ecstasy and love and everything that Mohan could ever imagine or even not imagine. So she is this fire. So when this small dry heart somehow gets ignited by this intense fire of love, and it can be in any small ordinary circumstance like uh, Gopika so nicely explained, brushing the hair of anybody combing, you know, and looking at the feet, it's about these beautiful feet, and I remember Swami's feet anywhere and everywhere, but most important is that it goes from inside to outside. So I was churning this in my heart debates that I can only, by the mercy of all of you, of Vrindavan, and having a melted and soft and humble attitude, develop this inner fire more. And that's why I'm so happy that you are all there. You are all full of fire of love and sharing this even like in a beautiful poem, waiting to be ignited, waiting to like, just like dissolve in this fire and forget it. Dissolving means forgetting all my material identities my material um, misconceptions of who I am and who I want to be and who I would like to be. No, I am already, I am by the mercy of Gurudev, Guru Manjari, all Chaitanya Mahaprabhu's associates who are still working on us now with this mercy. We are in this place in Vrindavan, in Kali Yuga even, mm -hmm. but we got the mercy that we can feel some deep, 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 intense desire to come more into this rather dirty moon. So, yeah, let's cry together, let's sing together, and let's uh, dance and party together <laughs> in the happiness of these feelings, and let's help each other to increase the feelings, and uh, let the feelings um, take over any, any misconceptions and not be afraid of <coughs> expressing but just like feeling and um, expressing everything you feel that is the way of Radha Dasi in the mood of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu and all our gurus, Vardas and especially Guru Manjari who is here with us today in this world, in this planet, in Vrindavan. So what else can be more happy, making us more happy? Thank you all for being there. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe, my dear. I'm happy because you are happy. Happy with us today. Happy with us today. Yeah. It's all about feeling. It is a sense of beauty. Now that I'm to her, I'm also inspired very much. But just something what manifests in my heart, and that is the following. You are so beautiful. Amazing colors, shining bright. Blue, pink, golden, and white. Beyond the rainbow in outer space, I can see your smiling face. You smile so colorful, like the sunset in summertime. And your tears are so refreshing, like raindrops in springtime. Yeah. Oh. You are the only. You are the one. You are the only one. You are so beautiful. Yeah. Looking into your eyes, 
I can see the sunrise. <laughs> and when you close your eyes, I can feel the moonrise. You are the only. You are the one. You are the only one. You are like a shining flower right next to me. And when you smile and whisper, I can feel your love breeze. This golden flower blossoming makes me dance and swing. <laughs> makes me dance and swing. And makes me play and sing. You are the only. You are the one. You are the only one. You are so beautiful. You are so beautiful. You are so wonderful. And you are so beautiful. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe. Radhe Radhe. How I say it's all about feeling that came, that manifested my heart. Radhe Radhe, Papa. All the feelings. <laughs> Shama Priya Maharani. Radhe One minute. Oh, it's such a beautiful thing. It's such a beautiful thing. Oh. I just wanted to say thank you to Radharani for the response that you give us every day, the coping of this family, like for all the small hearts in the way or the colors on the altar want to change what we planned in the dresses so or any day, any smile of any people. So I feel every day so many responses there and I pray for you. Please pray for me so that I can see it daily. Very difficult now, also, all these so nice, inspiring speeches and revealing their heart and. <laughs> To be here, I, it's it's for me. It's it's a miracle. I can only be rather unmoved, accept it, me coming, because I know, like before, we also heard it's so difficult to come, and I feel so blessed. And I just know, rather only knew I had to come. She knew I have to be here that I can make any progress, that I can make re realizations I, I just really need to make and Gopika was asking me to share and I feel I feel shy to share the realization because it's probably my material conception <laughs> if I am because everybody was asking was asking who, who sponsored this really nice dress and I didn't really want to say I was it because the sponsoring is the easiest part. I do work and I can sponsor it. But what, what really made the dress so special, Rosalina and Chiama Priya are so merciful that I could be part of making the dress, like going to buy the dish, the material, the yeah. fabrics and screws <coughs> and cut and put the stones and I didn't do any major work, I was just doing the little thing. But um, we always hear Seva brings us close to Radharani, and we are Dasis, Radha Dasis. And to think about that, to imagine is one thing, but then to really sit there and do this kind of work, this kind of Seva, and later on, see Radharani wearing this dress, and I know all these small secrets where we put something one does not know, see when does one doesn't know. <laughs> Some little presents we put. Um, I think this is the biggest gift I ever got, and this is really what 
makes my heart so much melt. And um, she, uh, Suniti said this morning when that she realized yesterday something happened with me. And this is exactly what happened finally, finally, after so many years. I I feel like there is a glimpse, a, a really small spark of realization. And I'm so thankful to all my both brothers, sisters, and Guru Dev for your patience, your love. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. Radhika. <laughs> my small baby. Radhika. I also. Um, I just uh, when uh, Gopika was sharing about the uh, uh, the puttas of Radharani, then I remembered when Leela did I heard uh, that we know we had the stuff that you were sharing and it was when Leela uh, during holy time where Radharani was playing with her girlfriends and and uh, with colors and everybody, everybody was flashed colors and uh, and then also during holy time they also mixed water and powder and then because there was also so much water the Nodarani's feet got very muddy and and also her dress and her knees and and then the sakis said to her lovingly that come Radhe we will wash you. You are very muddy. <laughs> and then she kept on ignoring them, like she didn't hear them. And and then she met Mohan. And even Mohan asked her that Radharani come, I will wash your feet. Why are you so muddy? <laughs> this is <laughs> this is not proper for you, my queen. And then Radharani still didn't want to respond to them. She said to Mohan that whoever or whatever has taken shelter of my feet or is attached here, then I cannot wash it away. Mm -hmm. So that was one very, very touching Lila for me to to just uh, what what is described in one of her most beautiful qualities, how compassionate she is. So this I also try to Remember, and this is also the poor that is doing that we are also like coming from, from like mud. And then, like Gopinath said, that then Guru Dev is like introducing us to Radharani. And uh, once one of her very dear dasis is introducing. Us to Radharani, then she also cannot, you know, cannot leave us even if we haven't even been able to take full shelter. So we shall also remember to and yes. Mangalati. <laughs> He can talk. Our English is very nice. Come in the plant, they are the trees out there. That's her. Plus Madhuri, plus Hugo, they are not, never shy. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Did you want to translate? I tried. I tried. I tried. I tried. I Translate. <coughs> what a beautiful picture. Mm -hmm. um. <laughs> yeah, Japanese are so hesitating to speak in English. So Saying in Japanese uh, yes. also, the, yeah. you say in Japanese, they will translate. Yeah. 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 Yes, yes, yes. They loud. Mm. Loudly, more. Mm. <laughs> Yesterday, you felt very happy day. No. no. Yesterday was a happy, very happy brother. Mm -hmm. But no idea. Loud. But, but I, I am very beginner, so I have no sharing. I have, I have, I don't have sharing, but yesterday. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, I participated in the um, drama theater with Bora Chandra, her husband. Her role, her character was Nandagaon, uh, an inhabitant in Nandagaon. And uh, And uh, uh, Radharani's role uh, was uh, featured by a baby. That baby was was uh, was not uh, try to uh, feature. But, but she thinks she saw that baby looks like a real Radharani. The baby was smiling very much and uh, yeah, moving, uh, dancing. So cute. And uh, around her, the happy mood was around her. Then, at that time, then, then she felt as if Radharani took the form of the baby. Yeah. So she felt very happy. And then the baby, then uh, from her heart, the happiness came around. And, and yeah, she, she filled with the uh, <laughs> and after that, in the afternoon, 
yesterday in front of temple. Yeah, she has a, had a chance of celebration from temple at us uh, throughout uh, present to children and and also uh, throw dishes and candy <laughs> then they are they are trying to <laughs> grabbing <laughs> that, <laughs> that food. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, some some people are jumping, try to get it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And yeah, and such mm -hmm. kind of things. <laughs> she she throw she threw candy mm -hmm. and the uh, <laughs> key door <laughs> and yeah, at that time yeah <laughs> she was really enjoying it yeah. yeah and sometimes to jumping to get that uh presents yeah. and at that time she felt that such celebrate blissful mood uh, were going around in the temple yeah and she felt very very much <coughs> sorry for my, my poor translation yeah, from from mangara arati san it's right to English. So she, you can speak. <laughs> yeah, she is uh, not good at uh, sharing like this, hesitating. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so she, she is uh, um, very. Uh, giving obeisance to the opening this ceremony of who? Sunidisan, Gopinath, Gopinath, and Sunidisan. Thank you so much. Yeah, and so, yeah, thank you very much. For the first time, she came to India. Is, is to hold on uh, uh, 2016 and, and the, the temple there. She she heard uh, the Hare Krishna mantra for the first 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 time 2016 at um, temple. And uh, she felt that mantra is so beautiful and that it and uh, as a mataji started to sound yeah. and the people there are, were starting to sing each other. She was, she didn't know that mantra then, but she feeling a crying because that mantra is so beautiful and impact. Mm -hmm. yes. Then after that soon, then she, she found, she came across the books of written by Jayananda Maharaj then she knew the meaning of mantra and, and, she, and she noticed that that book includes the all the information she was uh, searching around from the uh, little girl uh, mm -hmm. <laughs> 
after one month later, then she met Jayananda Maharaj directly. And then, then she had a chance to come to Vrindavan. At, at that time, she didn't know any um, scripture, any knowledge about this consciousness or Raga Nuga at that time. Then every year, then she, she came to Vrindavan. But yeah, she was busy for work and uh, did not give service, not so much. The, she didn't catch the real understanding of the scripture or bhakti yoga. Then after the uh, impacted by the COVID-19, then her work was slowly down. Then, yeah, she had a chance to give some service. Then now, she now finally came come here right now. Uh, her feeling uh, before was like a, a guest, but now but now she can give uh, deeper services and also can build deeper relationship with Ashka Vaishnavas. Yeah, <laughs> such is a hard feeling right now. <laughs> and yesterday, <laughs> yeah, she watched uh, a drama theater uh, played by Rasa Madhuri <laughs> and other, <laughs> yeah, other kids. <laughs> oh, she can she cannot watch <laughs> it. But she had another service. Then other uh, uh, she switched the relationship just with uh, COVID nineteen mm -hmm. to and the directly service to uh, Radharani. Yeah. Even though she was not there, at any time, yeah, she can do necessary service. Yeah, she noticed that fact. Every time, any time, she can uh, invade happy feeling. Yeah. Yeah. That, that, is, that is her experience. Thank you very much. Japanese are so hesitating. So, we want to hear from you also. Yes. Yeah. I'm very happy what you are doing. I will su suggest you that you continue this about uh, sharing about Radhika. We one day extra class. One more day. More day. 
and it should increase sharing their feelings and realization. If you agree, Gopinath and, uh, and the devotees and uh, uh, our Suniti, Didi, yes. then we can organize. The weekend is so devotees. far away, Guru. So it's good to have something during the week also. Yeah. One, one week, one Wednesday. 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 I do, I do. They like, eh? Mitte der Woche. Like the middle of the week. One, one day when they feel comfortable. So, uh, raise your hands if you are agree. <laughs> <laughs> Everybody. Everybody go there. One second, one second. Keep your hands raised. Don't let them down. So Gurudev can see. Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. No. Very nice. My yeah, Okay, so every Wednesday uh, this time, <laughs> yeah, four thirty. And normal class will be there. Friday, Friday is a Japanese class. Sridhar Maharaj. And uh, uh, Saturday, Saturday, Croatia, Russia, and Croatia. And Sadar Maharaj, Saturday is a Russia morning and Croatian class. Gopinath can give you a link, Radha Dasyam, you can find it. Yes, Maharaj, I will do. If you require the link, I, I'll share with you. Okay. Also, yeah, yeah, to all Vaishnava, then the world. Because Arti time is then the world in all Vaishnava's lotus feet and Maharaj lotus feet. Yeah, yeah, Maharaj. Your lotus feet, Maharaj. You are my shelter, always. You all Vaishnava is my shelter. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. How are you? Very happy. Yeah. Thank you, thank you, my dear. Kundalata. Yeah. Yeah. Tanagati, <laughs> 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 very nice, very happy. <laughs> Gauravati, very happy to see Radhe. 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 Thank you so much. <laughs> Thank you.